Kevin to point a few days ago because we were getting on to travel, and I just said to him, don't you point at me. And he pointed at me. Yes, he did, and he thought it was funny. So then, yeah, then he held up both fingers. Don't you point at me. Don't you point. Don't you point at me. Don't you point at me. I thought this was interesting. Decorate with fragrance. And this, uh, it says it provides a fresh fragrance for months. So you add it to your paint. And that's uh, crisp waters, clean linen, French vanilla, and tropical mist. So that's very interesting. Are you ready? Yes. <laughs> Evil. Evil, pure evil. <laughs> it's okay. What are you doing? Why were you on the elliptical? Huh? Why were you on it? What'd you say, Pug? Hello. Hello. You're awfully chatty. Awfully chatty. I was just doing a video on my elliptical and he decided he was going to get up there and sit because he wanted attention. He actually uh, let me hold him in my lap for a few minutes yesterday, which was shocking. And Guido has seemed really tired lately. Um, I mean, he hasn't thrown up or anything like that. But, uh, you know, he's, um, unfortunately, I'm uh, showing his age. He, um, he just seems tired all the time. I feel sorry for him. He still follows me around the house and everything, but um, he's he's getting old, poor baby. He's gained a little bit of weight, too. Um, I think that blue buffalo's put a little bit of weight on him, and we haven't been taking him for walks because he's so old, he gets out of breath, and then it takes him two hours to cool down, <laughs> so he's not getting the exercise. Since we moved into this house, it doesn't have... You know, we used to have a great big backyard he would run around, and we would uh, kick the ball and all that. In this yard, uh, you can't do that. So, um, he's definitely gained a little weight. Get it, Gavin. Pull. Pull it. Get it. Get that blanket. Get that blanket. Boo, 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 boo. <laughs> a boo, boo, boo. <laughs> a boo, boo, boo. <laughs> a boo, 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 boo. <laughs> a boo, 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 Ah, uh, I'm a big, big, You have mosquito bites still all over your arms and your head. Mos oh, don't the double point. Oh, no, the double point. Ah, don't you point at me. Don't you point at me. <laughs> you gotta quit pointing at me. That mosquito bite ah. looks terrible. You want me to put some calamine lotion on it? Let me put some calamine lotion on it. <coughs> and this is how we look with calamine <coughs> lotion. <coughs> oh, you want to stand up? Stand up. Don't act ugly. Now, can you jump? Where are you going? Get your toys. Do you like this nifty storage I came up with? The coffee cans. Yes, the free coffee cans. Right at the floor. What are you going to do now? Huh? 
butt here? What are we gonna do? Are we gonna play? Huh? Are we gonna play? Are you gonna echo into the kitchen? Say hello, hello, hello. Gavin, Gavin, Gavin. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? You like my coffee pot in the bathroom? Isn't that lovely? Lovely. Gavin, Gavin, Gavin. I don't know why he likes to come in here and play. Fortunately, I cleaned yesterday when he wasn't here. Yes, I did. I cleaned. Is that your telephone? Say hello. Hello. Yes. Yes, and he likes to... What was that? Say hello. Is somebody calling you on your phone? Hello. We don't even use the bathtub. This is just adorable. Gavin laying back Guido. Does he like you, Gavin? Is he your friend? Oh, he's a good friend. He's a good friend, isn't he? Is he your friend? Are you gonna pet the are you gonna pet Guido? Yes, pet Guido. Guido loves you. Guido's a good boy. Tell him, say, do it again. Do it again. <laughs> What's he do doing? Boy. What's with the stick of the tongue out today? He hasn't been sticking his tongue out. Every time he looks at me, he's going. <laughs> he thought that was funny. Miss Ashley brought McDonald's in, and she, so she's giving Gavin a French fry. Oh, is it so good? You like those French fries, don't you? He will, look, he's gonna try sweet and sour, Andrew. Oh, he kind of went. Oh, doesn't like the sweet and sour. Ah, uh, oh. Are you gonna give it up? He's not gonna give the French, but look, he's not giving giving it up. You can't actually get it yourself because that's disgusting. He could probably eat a whole French fry if you gave him a whole one. He would probably bite into it himself. I would like to see what he would do. Yeah, look, Andrew. Turn it he has a whole French fry. It's at the bottom on the right. At the bottom, that yeah, on the right. Yeah, right there. He's gonna carry it around. Are you gonna carry your French fry around? As long as he doesn't touch the curtains. Is it good? Oh. Is it good, Gavin? You gonna go show it to your papa? Are you gonna show it to your papa? I think papa might be painting. We have to leave him alone. This is our new place for hanging our uh, hoses. <laughs> Um, our other uh, device that came with the house broke. Um, I know how it broke, but I won't say. It was some people that came over to the house to work. They had their stuff leaning against it, so the plastic thing, so it broke off. Anyway, I found these hooks that were actually on the front porch when we first moved in, and I, I kept them. 
and so we put a hook here and a hook down here and we just put our hoses up this way and they're off the ground and they're out of the way you know you're not gonna uh, get caught on them or anything like that so that'll work um, I told Kevin he'll have to get the one from the top if we ever need it though because it's very heavy so but um, I thought that was a nifty way to, to store them. I'm kind of staying um, out of the backyard when I have Gavin, though, because uh, of his mosquito bites. He, um, he got some horrible mosquito bites, and I feel really, really bad for that because that happened here. And it's so funny because his parents had him at the park for like an hour and a half playing, and he never got bit once. And then he comes over here, and he gets bit like eight times or something. It's just ridiculous. Ashley got a package in the mail, and she's opening it. This is a very efficient opening way. Okay. She opened it with a big knife. I, I couldn't show it because our address is on it. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> my next classes start. I just finished my first class, and I literally got hundreds on everything. Praise Jesus. Um, literally on every assignment, and I'm thrilled. Um, and so I am bought my next two books that I'm going to need. The Art of Teaching Writing, the new edition, not just any edition, it's the new edition. But how would you know, like, what is new? Define new. Um, and plus, when was that made? 1922. Who knows? And then Foundations of Education, which was crazy expensive. It was like $121 was the cheapest I could find it. You couldn't rent it? Oh, really? Well, maybe this is rented. I don't know. Um, Can you s okay? What and there's are, no like packing list in here. No, there's nothing, mm -mm, and no. that's from Amazon. Yeah, no, there's nothing. I'm shocked. And there's nothing like on the outside of the box that says. I'm shocked. That's Who it's normal, from. They're really good about that. Yeah, that's weird. Uh, and Guido is waiting for a, a stick. Is it time for your stick? Is it eight o'clock? Is it almost eight o'clock? He's gotten used to coming in the dining room, and we're keeping his sticks up on top of the refrigerator. So, <laughs> I'm going to get one. There you go. I did rent it. And now he'll take it back in the hall. I did rent it. You this was not the expensive The expensive one is the math one, and I can't rent that one. That one was only $47.68. And then the art of teaching writing was uh, $23.98. So and you I, have more to come that are going to be expensive. Ah, uh, yeah. The math one will be super expensive because it's a huge book. It's very large. Um, and it's a hardback and you can't rent it. Um, plus, I'll probably use it later. So So how's your classroom come along? It's, 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 it's better than it was. But you have to, like, destroy to create. Like, so I had to take down all the bulletin boards and all the centers and all of everything. So it's it's a disaster. But you're going to do a classroom tour when you're finished, right? Yes. If I ever get finished. Ooh, so we got some Kroger coupons in the mail. Free one Kroger large eggs. A dozen eggs. That's awesome. Save $2 when you spend 10 in the meat department. These coupons, of course, are based on what we normally buy. Um, I like the getting the eggs free. Of course, we normally get a um, uh, ice cream free, so I doubt we'll be getting the free ice cream. Um, these desserts, we did a review on those desserts. That's something that we won't ever buy again. I can tell you that right now. They weren't good enough to buy again. Now, Kevin, Kevin liked these. Um, he really liked that uh, enchilada pie that he did a review on Lunchtime Review. But I don't know that he's up for buying those again because he went, ate so many of them. So, anyway, I'm always glad to get uh, Kroger coupons in the mail. Well, it is 7.16 and Big Brother doesn't come on till 9 o'clock tonight. So, Kevin and I will, I'm sure, try to get a shower before it comes on. Um, we just uh, finished eating dinner a little while ago and Ashley went with two other teachers from her school to Walmart. This is their like shopping night and um, I don't know if she'll bring the stuff home or take it to school. This is stuff I think that she's paying for herself out of her own money. Um, she actually has been watching a lady's house for a week while the lady was on vacation so she picked up some extra money doing that. So she's using 
that money and putting it towards the classroom. So I think that's great. It's her money to do with what she wants. So um, all that to say, I don't know that she'll bring the stuff here or take it straight to school and do a haul there. I just don't know. So um, anyway, that's where Ashley is. And then Kevin is there. <laughs> Jazz hands. <laughs> Um, but, um, anyway, Big Brother comes on tonight, and Kevin just reminded me I got really excited because tonight's a double eviction, and, uh, I know the contestants hate it, but at home we love it because that means they do twice as much meaty stuff, you know? Um, so last week, Amber went home, and this week, Zach, I'm looking at my computer screens because I'm horrible at the names. Zach and Jocasta are on the block. Kevin and I both hope that Zach will go home because he's been acting uh, a little erratic here and there. He just, it, it, we haven't liked him for a long time anyway, honestly. So we hope Zach goes home. And then since it's a double eviction, who knows what's going to happen. Um, um, Nicole was hoping that, that she would be able to put Frankie on the block. And I'm glad that didn't happen because I really like Frankie, and I'm not ready for him to go home yet, so I hope he doesn't go home, um, but uh, anyway, that's what we're doing tonight, and so I think I'm going to end the video here, and uh, I'm sorry that I haven't been doing uh, as much vlogging lately, it just seems like we, we've had a lot of reviews come out, um, and so I don't know, I figure people would rather see reviews anyway, um, then see me. So, <laughs> see me vlog is what I mean. So, anyway, good night for now, and, um, hopefully I'll have this up Friday. Try to do it. I'm going to try to work on it right now. So, good night.